you just watch other people out there, you get kind of a little bit mesmerised by it and one day a friend of yours lets you have a go and the next minute you're buying one, so that's pretty much how it goes. It's just like anything really, if you're, if you're riding your bike down a hill fast and you think, oh, this, I might, I might sl slip on this corner, I might fall off, you know, you're probably more likely to. I think it's, the attitude is, is that you're going out there and you're pushing it hard and you know you're on the edge, but you're fully switched on to that moment and you know, you can feel the boat and you know what the boat wants and you know what the boat can handle. So it's about keeping the boat on the edge and knowing where that limit is and not worrying about coming off because generally you only know about when you've come off after you've come off. From the moment that you pull the sail in and sit on the side, it feels very much like a conventional conventional dinghy. And then uh, as the boat speed increases, the force starts to generate lift and the boat starts to lift out from the water. And the silence happens when you start to get up on the foil. Everything goes quiet and then you're just about to start here a small singing from the foils as the speed drastically increases from around eight knots up to sort of 13, 14, 15 knots within a second or so. So it's that, that initial feeling that, that really gets you. You'd think that the water's soft, but when you're doing 25 knots it isn't. I've, I've often capsized in, in a pitch pole and bounced several times, just like you would do if you were out wakeboarding, but you're probably going a little faster to be honest. The Moth is one of the few boats where you can just go out for a sail in an evening, in an afternoon, you know, it doesn't even need to be anyone else on the water and you can enjoy your sailing. Um, and, th and that feeling has never left me after five years, the enjoyment of just going sailing. But racing it is just the next level, it's the absolute pinnacle for me of uh, high performance sailing and close quarters racing and um, it's a great feeling to be out there battling around at high speed knowing that you know, if you make a small mistake or someone else makes a small mistake, then um, you, know, you, can, you can pass someone or get past. So it's very tense, it's very on the edge, and it's just it's great fun.